Hey guys, what's going on? It's Sorful here. Uh, today I'm going to be showing you guys some Xenon training along with his fourth job advancement. Now the reason why I'm including training in this video is not only to show you guys a really cool spot to train uh, for levels 90 to 100, but also because the fourth job advancement is extremely short and it's not because it's pretty much an auto job advancement. So um, I, I wanted, I didn't want the video to be too short. I wanted to show you guys some training as well. So this is why I included this, and it's a really, really awesome spot. And keep in mind that this uh, EXP that I'm getting is, I believe, on one times EXP. So like I've been here on two times EXP, and it's just ludicrous. Like it's crazy. And so make sure you come here. Uh, pretty sure it's the best spot for level 90 to 100, and you won't regret it. So that being said, um, a little that I want to talk about is me kind of wanting to go back to my Night Lord after I'm done with my DB, of course. Um, this video is kind of old because I did quit my Xenon four days ago or so. It did reach level 120 and I've been heavily considering going back to my Night Lord since Tyrant equips are a lot more often now in the FM. In the FM. They're a lot more common now. Uh, the prices went down quite a bit. They're like actually 5 bill now. 5.5 maybe. And um, I really want to start funding my Night Lord to the maximum. Uh, like pretty much get maybe some Rudibus Thief gear on him and along with uh, Tyrants. So I'm heavily considering going back to him and full force or uh, but it's not even a or it's just a matter of when because I have all these thief equips that are tradable that I spent so much time buying for my shadower if you guys remember and now they're of course on my dual blader because I did quit my shadower and I just don't know when I'm gonna be done with my dual blader like if it was up to me I would sell them today or try to sell them today because I'd rather go to my Night Lord as opposed to play my DB for any longer. But I'll, I'll push my DB, hopefully get him to level 170 because I do want that hyper skill. Like, that's what I want for my DB, the hyper skill, that OP hyper skill that's just crazy. And so we'll see what happens there though, but let me know what you guys think. You guys think I should go back to the Night Lord, the original OG Sorful NL? The reason why I made this YouTube account, the... Uh, first character you guys ever seen of mine? Should I go back to that? Uh, right now anyway? Or should I stick with the DB for a little while and you know see where that takes me? So just let me know in the comment section below and right now in the video you're seeing the fourth job advancement I was training at captains and crews uh, not not a very good spot to be honest like I didn't like it at all but some people might like it it'll definitely be in my training guide and so stay tuned for that as well uh, like I said, I have a lot of videos lined up, and yeah, that's pretty pretty much it for the videos and stuff. But um, right now I don't know if I should have cut me looking through the skills and choosing which ones to pit. Uh, let me know for future reference though if I should not show you guys this portion of the video and instead just show you guys the job advancement and then straight into using the skills because yeah, I think I kind of forgot to stop fraps but at the same time I want to hover over all the skills and let you guys read it you guys could like pause the video on it if you guys want to read it so let me know though if I should do that in the future or not um yeah I pretty much put the three first skills that pretty much anyone would take so it's not really a big deal but Xenon 4th job is really where it gets interesting especially because of that beam dance skill that skill is just ridiculously fun and ridiculously strong like I really really love using it. It's super super fun. It's like the DB's 170 hyper skill, but better because there's no cooldown. You can spam for as long as you want, and yeah, you get it at level 100 instead of 170. So it's really really crazy, and yeah. So Xenon Fort Job, pretty cool class overall. Not too fun like I mentioned in my previous videos, but um, I see a lot of people planning to main this class. But the thing. If you guys plan on maining him, you guys should take a look at some KMS patch notes because he does get nerfed pretty hard. Like, he's not going to be the same. It's like uh, Angelic Buster. The nerf Angelic Buster's got, like the f initial one, that nerf was disgustingly harsh. And I think the Xenon one could almost compare it to that one. So be careful on which classes you main because, of course, when a new class comes out, they're always going to be overpowered. 
uh, for the most part anyway, not all of them, but most of them. And they obviously have to get nerfed because that's just how it goes. Um, the only class that I could really think of that wasn't really overpowered when it came out was Hayato. Hayato's not overpowered at all, if you ask me. He's just really, really fun to play. And I was playing him the other day and I was like, damn, I miss this guy. Like, if I still had my percent strength stuff, I would have still played him and stuff. So, yeah, I just have so many characters that I want to play, refund, and it's just crazy. It's overwhelming at some points because I do have full 20 characters. Like, and I have one slot open for my Demon Avenger, so it's just crazy. And uh, you guys could definitely expect um, some Demon Avenger videos from me. Hopefully I can put out all my Dual Blade videos that I have set up for you guys out before Demon Avenger comes out. But um, we'll see. Because uh, remember I have a schedule to go by. So we'll see what happens. And But definitely you could expect some Demon Avenger videos coming from me. And um, I have the Playlist Wednesday coming out this Wednesday of course and of course another video coming out Friday for you guys so come back check back on those dates and stay tuned and also another thing although tomorrow is playlist Wednesday it's also an extra special day for me because tomorrow is in fact my birthday yes my birthday is on July 10th and you might want to take tabs of that because the NX giveaway is coming out soon and I've decided what I'm gonna do I'm gonna do for it so it's gonna be a little survey so make sure you brush up on your uh, studying if you want a shot at some free NX and you know may the best person win so yeah um, that being said tomorrow I'm gonna try and upload the video ASAP because obviously I'm gonna be kinda busy tomorrow and yeah we'll see how things go so if I don't upload a video I highly doubt I won't do it but just in case if I don't uh, you know why so please excuse me if I don't but I'm pretty sure I will but that's just in case better safe than sorry um, so that pretty much wraps up this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, I just hit 3,000 subscribers, so thank you all for subscribing. I uh, really appreciate it. Keep it up, please. And I'll definitely do my best to keep up what I do. So thank you all for watching. This has been a Soul for Production. I'll see you all next time. And play safe. Peace.